One of the most basic questions people have when they start to think about going solar is how many solar panels do I need? And the answer, as we love to say in the solar industry, it depends. Everyone's needs are unique. And the number of solar panels that you'll need varies based on a few different factors and will require a bit of math to figure out. But don't worry, we'll walk you through the process step by step so you'll know how many solar panels are needed for your specific home. You can determine how many solar panels you need for your home in just four steps. So let's get into it. Step one, find out how much electricity you use. The first part of deciding how many panels you'll need for your home is figuring out your electricity usage. You can find this number by checking your most recent utility bill. If you look towards the bottom of your electric bill, it usually states how much electricity you used that month and it'll be measured in kilowatt hours. Pro tip, you'll be able to get a more accurate estimate by looking at your annual usage. So if you're able to get your hands on your electric bills for the last 12 months, just add them all together and divide by 12. And that will give you an idea of how much you consume on average. Step two, see how much sunlight your home gets. Sunlight is crucial for the output of your solar panels, and the amount of sunlight that hits your roof can all depend on where you live in the U.S. How much sunlight an area gets is measured in what's known as peak sun hours. And this is a concept that takes all the sunlight from a day and converts it to how many hours of full sun that equals. The average of peak sun hours across the USA is around five hours per day, but it varies widely. For example, sunnier states like Arizona get between seven and eight peak sun hours per day, and a state like Massachusetts gets more like 4.5 to 5 averaged over the year. We have an entire article on solarreviews.com about peak sun hours that includes a full list of the average peak sun hours in all 50 states. We'll link that for you down below so you can find yours. Step three, determine what size solar panel system you need. To do that, you'll divide your monthly usage by the average monthly peak sun hours your state gets. Let's take a look at an example. Let's say your electric bill says your home used 1200 kilowatt hours of electricity last month. Let's also say that you live in a state that gets five peak sun hours per day or roughly 150 hours in a month. So when you take 1200, divide it by 150, that equals eight, meaning you need an eight kilowatt system. Now that you've determined your system size, that leads us to the fourth and final step, calculating how many solar panels you need. Using the number of your system size, you take that and divide it by the output wattage of whatever solar panels you're using. Most solar panels used in residential projects today have a power rating of about 400 watts or 0.4 kilowatts. It will read on a data sheet as maximum power or rated power, nominal power or Pmax and it's almost always measured in watts. But when you plug the power output into the equation, just be sure you remember to convert that number into kilowatts. Let's run the numbers. An eight kilowatt system divided by 0.4 kilowatts per panel is equal to 20. So your final answer is that you need 20 solar panels for your system. We hope you can now start your solar journey with a better understanding of how to calculate the amount of solar panels you need for your home. All additional resources mentioned in this video will be linked down below. We'll see you next time.